here we evaluate products, but that process starts with identifying a chef. The first day I sat down in training, they said to us, you'll never look at food the same. What is that taste or flavor in an item? As a chef, when I'm cooking, when I'm preparing food, I do break them down into these different elements. You need to be able to recognize what quality is. And through our experiences, you get that. They have to understand panel dynamics, panel behavior. They have to be comfortable with the panel and learn how to articulate. We're very careful to provide enough information that they know what's in front of them, but not too much information to bias them. We're asking them to act as a precise instrument. We have to make sure our chefs can tell differences. So we're all about understanding repeatability and reliability. Not so much as to be trained to give a response, but to understand how you can use your perceptions and identify intensities and articulate those perceptions. It's a really interesting dynamic as we get the group together and have all these chefs. Each one of us brings different skills, knowledge into the process. We come up with a consensus as a group about what this product is and what it should be. This is all this descriptive process of experiencing the products, thinking about them in terms of their senses. We take a lot of time to do that, but we come to a consensus as a group. Just approaching every project with that type of an eye and being as meticulous as we can about setting it up, the training we put our judges through, it makes for a better outcome.